Thank you. Um, so the, um, the fact that this meeting wasn't able to go ahead does mean that we are not able to um, challenge the decision that was made at the Combined Authority Board um, on the 30th of May. Uh, that doesn't necessarily mean we can't scrutinise that decision. We will be able to discuss it at our next scrutiny meeting, which is um, a week on Monday, but we will not be able to get the decision overturned. Um, in the context of this decision, I don't think that's a huge disaster because actually the, um, the meeting, um, the Combined Authority Board are reviewing this decision in July anyway, and I hope that some of the discussion that happened at our in at meeting today will help to inform the Board's decision making when they come back to review this matter in July. Um, our big concern is over the um, potential delay to seriously needed public transport improvements around Cambridgeshire. The Mayor has asked for a pause um, on a number of schemes and some of those schemes are really urgently needed. So I hope that when that decision does come back to the Board in July, um, they will be giving um, very serious consideration to whether any kind of delay to those projects is um, a good thing or not. You mentioned a couple of times that um, the, the absentee councillors appear to be all from, or, or mostly from, the Conservative group. Uh, do you think, I mean, Councillor Gehring made a few kind of allusions to this perhaps being a political tactic. Do you think that this was in any way deliberate or do you think it's simply a case of maybe geography or misunderstanding? I genuinely don't know. I am very concerned that, um, that, it, that there may have been um, some kind of deliberate policy not to turn up and I will be writing to um, the councillors involved to find out what their reasons were and, and, um, and to express the frustration of those of us who did come because there were a number of councillors who came quite a considerable distance um, to attend this meeting and for them to, to do that and then find that their journey had been wasted uh, was very frustrating indeed. Um, so I, I, I wouldn't like to say, but it certainly does seem interesting that, um, that only one Conservative councillor was able to attend. Does the Scrutiny Committee have real teeth or do you think this is an organisation, the Combined Authority, that goes largely unchecked? Well, I do think that the Combined Authority has gone largely unchecked. Um, I think that the, the Scrutiny Committee could have real teeth if it um, chose to use them, but I think it is very difficult to... Uh, if one poli political group is not willing to challenge, um, then, then that's, that's a bad situation to be in, um, and we really need to be um, making sure that that is not possible in the future and is not the case in the future, because I think that the... the the Mayor's um, method of operating does mean that it particularly requires scrutiny. Councillor Etzinger, thank you very much.